welcome in this video we're going to go over how to create scatter plot using open charts so let me just refresh the site now this is of course an open source tool which i've developed and yeah let's upload the iris data set and so once you upload your data set um, you can go ahead and decide if you want to show it you know how many number of rows let's say i want to show six rows and of course this is it here i can expand it as well but i'm just gonna do this and select the theme but that's going to be useful after the charts have been made so let's say i want to see sepal length versus petal length you know use um the petal width for size and color it by the species okay there are other things i can add but this is what the chart looks like right now this is done you know using streamlit and i can decide to provide sepal width as the over name right so you know anytime anyone goes over it they can see that and um yeah so let's say i want to add box plots on the y-axis i can set up the marginal y Unless I want volume plots on the x-axis, I can do that as well. Um, if I don't want this to be logarithmic axis, I can change it to false. And now it's just normal axis, as you can see. Um, I could give it a title, say Iris data set. Let's go in. And the title is over there. So there are much more things you know i can specify but i believe this is fine for now i can also facet it into raw column if i want to let me show you what that is um okay so it just splits it by the species so let's say i don't want to do that let's say i want to split it on the column by the species you know pretty much the same thing right but we don't need to do that so just gonna leave it as is now that you have your chart, um, you can go ahead and export it into different formats. So you have it as PNG, JPEG, PDF, SVG, HTML, JSON. And for this, uh, let's do PDF. So you wait for it to load, it takes a little bit, then you click on download, and then it shows up here as a PDF. All right, so this is open charts. And let's say you want to export it as, let's say, HTML. You know, you let it load a little bit, download that, and we can open it. And it's going to have the interactivity we so much love with Plotly Express Plots. So you can see this. Um, this is just an example of things you can do here, which is great and yeah so these two charts were created using this open chat software and you know as i keep saying open charts is an open source tool um you can contribute code to it um you know you can see the code that runs it and you know things of that nature lastly you can also change the theme here so these are some of the themes available in Plotly Express. You can see, you can keep changing it to different themes as you deem fit. Um, I I think I really like this Seaborn theme. So I can stick with this. This is fine. So this is what the tool can do. And this is how you make scatter plots. Okay. Thank you very much. And I'll see you in the next video.